with another vlog guys this week I'm gonna be in Peru yeah bathroom so nice and sleek I don't know if this is a new hotel, but everything is so modern and clean. The beds are really small. I don't know. I think I might try to push them together. Because I have a feeling like I will fall. Got my safe and everything. Let's check out the view. Yeah, so not really much. <laughs> okay, so anyway, I'm going to take a shower and eat and possibly sleep because I had to get to the airport at around midnight and as usual I didn't sleep only slept in and out on the plane yeah and that was it and now it is quarter past two in the afternoon so i'm pretty beat so i'll catch you guys later okay so we just got lunch we went back to one of the hole in the wall type places um we went to early in the week this Arabic place last time I got a shawarma but I would say like okay this time let me try something different so I ordered a cheeseburger and mind you the picture it looked like a cheeseburger I'll put up a picture here of what a cheeseburger is supposed to look like and <laughs> they were just laughing because this is the end result I see the man put a patty on the grill but yeah i don't know what this is supposed to be <laughs> a gyro with a party inside yeah so that's a bit funny <laughs> should have just ordered a shawarma in the first place
Okay, so the time is currently 11.36 and I am now eating dinner. We came back to the hotel probably around um, half 10, I'm not quite sure, but I know that I did spend 13 hours at the venue today. And then, as usual, whenever I'm in Peru, I'm unable to order food online. That is my biggest pet peeve. Other than that, everything else is okay. But yeah, I had to go down to reception again to see if they can help me. Um, this time they weren't able to. And I'm like, oh my gosh, please Jesus. I just need just a little bit of food before I go to bed. And I honestly thought ordering online would have been faster than maybe walking, finding somewhere. And I don't, I don't really want to walk by myself 11 o'clock in the night looking for food. So, after one more try on one of the apps, I finally got some food. Okay, so obviously it's not the best, but I'm gonna, this is my little treat for being out for 13 hours at the badminton courts. So it's not something I do every day, but I got to treat myself tonight. I'm so excited for this. Six hours later. Okay, so one of my most hated and tedious activities whenever I'm on tour is washing. 
the laundry. So, especially if I need to stay more than a week, I'm taking part in two tournaments back to back. I definitely need to wash before I go to the next tournament. So that one will be the Guatemala Future Series. So I have a lot of dirty laundry. I have four bags from the strip alone due to training and matches and so on. The good thing is I started a couple of days ago just doing a couple of things. I'm leaving early tomorrow. So this hopefully will be the last set that I need to wash. Yeah. So I'm just trying to get as much done because I was over 11 hour layover. I'm not getting in till 11 p.m. any night. But what gets me through it a little bit faster is I either listen to a podcast or watch a show. Right now, I started a new series on Netflix. So I'm just going to watch while I wash. <laughs>